Now, another thing you might like to experiment with is modifying the parts within the performance during playback. We don't have to actually stop the demo tune for this. Go to performance, and we see the performance, again, temporary, user one, body noise. Now, pressing F3 accesses the individual parts of that performance. And the display we have here is known as the edit palette. It shows us parts nine through to 16, or parts one through to eight, as a single group. We can then use the cursor controls to edit particular parameters associated with each part, and we can compare the parts because of the neat way the data is laid out. For example, the patch number, the part level, so this will be the level for part two, and so on. I can also make changes to the effects, F5. Change the reverb send level for part one. or the amount of chorus on part four. An alternative to using the edit palette is to go straight for the particular part and view all the information associated with that one part.